And welcome back everybody to Mario Galaxy. ICTH here and Alright, now we're gonna go ahead and point at the screen and we're gonna go to this new galaxy here known as the e Loop de Loop Galaxy. Now I kinda hated this galaxy when I first uh did it. Mostly because of the controls. You'll see them in a minute. Uh, we're going to go into Surfing 101, which is the only star in this galaxy, actually. Thank God, because this one is like, <laughs> yeah. But there's Ray, and yeah, <coughs> you have to control that thing. Mm, excuse me. <coughs> but yeah, I right, start off with a little bit of a couple of penguins. <laughs> this is Penguin Paradise. Okay, uh, sure. Why not? Go ahead and grab us a star bit and pop the Mr. Penguin right here. Race surfing isn't so easy, so listen to what Coach has to say. That cute little guy over there is Ray. Okay, yeah, um, let's go over here. Are you a surfer too? Yeah, sure, why not? Oh, but this is your first time race surfing, right? Well, then let me show you the ropes. Oh, here, and here's your controls. <coughs> now, let me explain. Point your thing at the screen. Okay, what you're gonna do is the tutorial, just point your Wiimote the screen. Yeah, yeah, that's the basic position. Just turn left, twist the Wiimote left from that starting position. Okay? <coughs> Correct, that's how you turn left. Turn right, you gotta twist your thing to the right. Like so. That's how you turn right. Then all you need to do is hold down A to speed up. That's all you need to know. Now give it a go on the course. Yeah, um, this kind of, yeah, you can tell how I'm stir steering this thing, that this is not, probably not going to turn out so well, um, <laughs> but yeah, um, I kind of hated this mission really badly, can't you tell, <laughs> but yeah, it's kind of hard to maneuver him, the way I held the Wiimote, hold the Wiimote, I kind of actually, when I turn my wrist, it kind of hurts a little bit to the, when I turn it to the right. And it's kind of like I'm almost jerking it, like, all the way over for some reason. It's, it kind of hurts a little bit. So this mission was kind of a, kind of a tricky one. But yeah. All you need to do is beat that best time of a minute and 30 seconds. I think they give you a little bit of leeway, but I think it's, I think also if you take too long, you die, so you want to try to make it as fast as possible, but don't, uh, don't rush yourself too much to the point where you end up, uh, killing yourself, but yeah, see, now I'm doing it all MLG style up in this piece, like a boss, <laughs> I've actually picked up on how to do it, you see, there's something, a little something I forgot though. You still have control of the thing as you as you um, cross the goal line. So <laughs> yeah, uh, I kind of died. Um, <laughs> and yeah, let's try that again. But yeah, it's even after you um, get past the goal, it records your best time. So yeah. So now we're gonna go through this again. And stuff. Yeah. And and we're gonna fail. <laughs> like so. Cause we're awesome. We are indeed awesome like that. that too bad, that's nothing. <sighs> Alright, let's try this again. Um third time's the charm, right? Good luck. Uh, we all are assholes. <laughs> uh, anyway, um yeah. Not much I can say here. I, I mean, I died twice. I think twice I missed that free life, so... Yeah. <laughs> the third time's the charm. Right, right, right. Can, can, can I get an amen there? Um, okay. Third time is indeed the charm. We're gonna... We're gonna get this done. We're gonna do it. We're gonna... Oh, never mind. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Uh, there's not a saying for the fourth time, right? 
Um, but yeah. I told y'all, race, race surfing is not my best, it's not my forte. Um, but yeah. Alright, so around the corner, body daddy, we like the body. Mm -hmm. Body daddy, all that good stuff. We're gonna go around. Um, yeah, my commentary again is starting to slip. Well, you try, you try commentating over something you've seen literally four times. And turn around and, and try to make it interesting. Okay, I'm pretty sure um, people who have already LP'd this game. Uh, let me see. Three I can remember off the top of my head are Donna Bells, Chugga Conroy, and SSOH, as far as I can remember. I think SSOH didn't finish it, but I'm not too sure. But yeah. <laughs> okay. We made it this time, and this time we actually remember that we can actually control it. I said actually a lot. Hold on. 1 minute 3.18 seconds. Congratulations. You deserve a gold medal. And also my voice changed from that penguin. I don't care. <clears throat> he's, in, he's in shock and awe <laughs> that I beat his high, his high score. But yeah. Step up on the podium, grab the star, and we'll never have to see this place again. <laughs> Yay! But yeah, as we watch the star go into the thing, and five stars, no, six stars, Galaxy can wait! There we go! Therefore, we never see half see at, never see half to see, what the hell? Never have to see at Galaxy again, thank you, Yahoo! Um, okay, we're going to save, we're going to go back here into, um, since I only have six stars, we're gonna go back into the into a galaxy here. Go into the I didn't know which one to go into, so we went in the good egg this time. And decided to go back. I only thought there were two stars for a galaxy and boy was that wrong. We're gonna go in here and go to King Caliente's Battle Fleet. Alright, we'll go ahead. Yep, as you notice, there's that big ass black hole and some airships. Hey, we found Bowser. Oh, game over. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm kidding, obviously. But, um. Yeah, we're back to this galaxy here. This good egg galaxy. You see that launch star up there? Um. It's like there's a bonus actually right underneath that launch star. Which, after I read this. Gone for a long time. Need to get in? Use the pipe on the other side. That's a you know, I'm I'm too boss to go use a pipe on the other side. So why don't I just wall jump <laughs> and stuff to where I can't even see the camera. <laughs> so I just tried it once and said screw it. <laughs> um but yeah. Like over there, I believe you can actually see a bit of the, um, of another galaxy over there. That or that's part of the, um, good egg, which I don't believe it is. I don't recall it being there, unless I'm sadly mistaken. Um, but yeah, you can see all the other galaxy, all the other, um, planet so this galaxy over there like the capsule and that llama bean uh, thing or whatever they call those Russian thingies where they had the smaller version of the uh, doll inside the doll and stuff but yeah star bits <laughs> lots and lots of star bits because I want to make up those lives I lost in the loop de loop galaxy or is loop de swoop I, I don't know I don't remember anyway I think this is more or less I'm just trying to collect star bits for no good reason. But yeah, there's no pull star up here this time because, well, this is a whole different mission. Where we need to go is that uh, launch star up there. Um, but yeah, in the tunnel, and we're in a bonus room. Don't worry, you can't fall off the edge because that's just background. But, you collect this coin and a lot of notes will appear. You collect all these notes and you get a reward. 
And I think this set of notes actually plays the underground theme from Mario 1, 3, uh, and some other games, I don't remember, and I think 64. But yeah, uh, sorry I'm adjusting my mic. But the reward is a free life. Yep, get it? Get your one up. Go down the pipe and you end up on top of the house, I believe. Yep. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I think in my practice file, I found out a way you can actually wall jump over that. But anyway, we're here. We're with some crystallized toads. Woo! You saved me! Thanks, Mario! In return, let me tell you a secret about this place. Apparently, those spike things just hate coconuts. Shake your thing to spin and smack them with coconuts. I love how I got a picture of a coconut beside the word coconut. Really, Toad? We're not we're not idiots. Um, but yeah, you just launch these um coconuts into um into these um into the spiky plants and. I I think you'll get star bits. I think one of them gives. One of them is a launch star, I believe. Um. Well. I think it's this one. You can tell. He, uh, yeah, it's a sling star, actually. I'm sorry. But, um. Obviously, Mario cannot. I mean, he. He was good in Strikers, but he's not. His. Ever since Strikers and Strikers charged his, um. Soccer skills kind of went south, um, but yeah. But you got this now. With this planet, you got this big ass pokey just sitting there, just chilling. And dirt poke is just gonna slam, hit, slam, slam his face into the ground, trying to smush him. Um, what you wanna do is hit him with a coconut and ground pound his head, or or sit on his head or something. But yeah, I fell off the thing trying to get a coin. Then you got another launch star launching you to Chomp, uh, Chomp Planet, which I think there's something on that planet on Chomp Planet, but I didn't notice. Also, I didn't know. I mean, I actually didn't know what those were. Those little um platforms. Then I noticed there was a uh, Chomp falling in there. Oh, <laughs> almost got ran over. But yeah, another a chomp one. There's that's a chomp uh, drop off point. Which Mario can't go into. But yeah, what we do is this. Try to get on this side of the planet. Watch out for the bullet bills. In this game, bullet there's like these. I mean, the bullet bills in this game are kind of like the ones that are in um, Mario 3, the homing bills. The ones in, uh, what world was that that had the some of Was it five or four? I don't remember. But yeah, I remember that stage because you can get a Tanuki suit out of it. It was awesome. I think it was four. Oh well, enough about, um, Mario 3. We're gonna go ahead and continue Mario Galaxy, huh? <laughs> but yeah, take the launch star up to the airships. Anyone else remember that UFO, though? From, um,. The intro? Uh, but yeah, somehow that you just gonna put a box that has nothing in it. Um, what you wanna do is spin into these coconuts and launch them back at the um, octopi that were up there shooting at you. Um, then take these stairs here. Uh, watch out for octopus. And I think there's a there's something in one of these boxes. I don't remember. I think it's that box over there. You see right here? This one? Yeah, there's a life shroom. Get the life shroom, your health will grow to six uh six pieces. But if it drops before below four, then the life shroom's gone and you're back down to three. And stuff. But yeah. You really want to keep that life shroom for as long as possible. And I think they give you one after each uh, before each boss. I'm not really sure. I think there's some stages that give you one, just give you one, but I don't know. Anyway, take the launch star up to the next planet. There's Huma. Be careful. There's big, big danger up ahead. If things get really bad, shoot a star bit and one of those lights on the ground. 
Then a coin will pop out. Grab it to replenish some of your life. Okay. Well, you see those lights right there behind that luma? You want to do that? You want to launch the, um, stars, I mean, that thing that the, um, lights and the star bits of the lights and get coins. But hey, look, it's King Caliente. Uh, his attack pattern is kind of simple. First, he'll launch three coconuts, then one green one, three fiery coconuts, and one green one. I'm gonna spin jump into the green coconuts to um to hit him. All right, then then second time he blocks the first hit, then just spin back into it. The set, third time he's gonna be very pissed. Then launch out these fiery blue things. I don't know the official name for them, but they can be a pain in the ass when you're trying to um trying to do this. So what you want to do is just watch out for those. Or if you're like me, you can take a hit. But um, but yeah, play a little bit of tennis with them and destroy them. Don't know why he doesn't block it on the third hit. That's my, that's beyond me. I don't know. But you want to go ahead and take this star over here. Yeah, don't try to long jump into the lava or around the lava. You know what I mean? Cause that's that's stupid. Why would you do that? Um, but anyway, yeah. Go ahead and grab the star. You got the star. All right, partner. And yeah, there you go. We got the next star. Luma is happy, and Mario's hat goes back in his hat. We got seven stars. Blah da. All this stuff and. I think well, hey, we discovered a new galaxy, which is right there. I think that's that other galaxy we haven't discovered yet. Hey, Hungry Luma! I think in the next episode we're gonna handle both Hungry Luma and uh, that new galaxy. Till next time, sayonara, bacas. See you next time.